These are my IKEA must-haves. If you've been following me for a while, you know I love IKEA and most of my furniture is from IKEA. I have a lot of decor from IKEA. A lot of my kitchen stuff is IKEA. And today I'm gonna to show you my must-haves. So hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Lucy for anyone that is new. And yeah, I'm just gonna get straight into it. First, I'm gonna start with the kitchen stuff because I feel like most of my kitchen is Ikea. You will see if you've watched my everything I bought from Ikea for my new apartment haul, which I'll pop here. I basically kitted my whole kitchen out with Ikea bits. So, first up is this pasta bowl. I have this pasta bowl in this colour and a pale pink. They do loads of different colours. And I personally feel like this is the perfect plate. Like, I don't eat from a plate that often. Like, I just love to have things in a pasta bowl. And I feel like Ikea do the best pasta bowls because they're not too big, not too small, like they're just right. Um, so yeah, I would literally have a burger, I'll have anything and I'll just pop it in a pasta bowl. Even though it's not pasta and it's breaking the rules. I just love a pasta bowl and Ikea do really good ones. So yeah, this is my first must have. Then for glassware, Ikea do so many nice glasses. Um, I could literally buy a glass for every drink that I don't even drink in there because I just go in and I'm like, oh my God, these are so nice. So first up, we have this wine glass, which I just love. I also love that the stem is really thin and it's got like a little flat base. I love this wine glass. I don't even really drink wine that much, but I will use these and I will happily have, have like water in this. Um, I just feel so bougie drinking from it and I love them. So I actually have these on display. Um, they come in a pack of six. In the video I am going to show here, I actually only have five out at the moment because one of them is in my dishwasher. Yeah, I just love these. I had these at my parents' house as well and I just feel like they're just so nice. Then we have these. Now, I first discovered these at my friend's house. She had them and I was like, oh my God, those glasses are so nice. And they were from Ikea. So I had to buy myself some. I'm not going to lie, I don't drink out of them that much, but I have them on display again and I just love how they look. Um, I am, I keep meaning to do this, but I've not done it yet. I want to add like fruit and stuff in them and like have them as a dessert kind of bowl because I feel like they would take it because the, the base is quite wide. So yeah, I'd love to do that. Like when I have friends around, like make a little dessert and put them in these glasses because I just feel like they're so pretty. They also have different ones as well, which have a lid on. And I think they're made for desserts a little bit more, but I feel like these would do desserts just as well. Um, so yeah, cheers. <laughs> then I probably use this on a daily basis. So I need to include it in here. It's just like a pan, like protector. I actually don't know what this is called. Basically what you put a hot pan on so you don't work, burn your worktops. And obviously I'm renting, I don't wanna burn any of my worktops. So I will reach for this on a daily basis just to protect the worktops. And you, they come in a pack of three and I just feel like they're so handy, like I literally use it every day. Um, I even like if I'm getting an oven tray out and I just need to put it on the side, I'll get one of these out and put the oven tray on top um, as well as pans. So yeah, it's really good, I don't burn anything. Then we have these, which I use in the kitchen, but in the past I've used for like laundry and um, pods and stuff like that. I just feel like they're very versatile, nice little jar to have. I have snacks from these at the moment, but like I said, I've had them for like laundry pods, I actually am debating doing that again because I feel like it just looks really nice with the laundry pods in. But you could use it for like makeup or like cotton pads. Like you could put anything in here. And I've seen as well like people put biscuits in them and have them on display and I feel like that always looks really nice. Um, so yeah, I highly recommend these. I also have the tall version which I have pasta in and I have them on out on display. Pasta I'm going to show you. I need to refill. <laughs> it's looking very sad and sorry because there's not that much pasta in the jars. I literally go through pasta so much. So I need to refill those jars. Um, but yeah, I have the taller ones. I have this size. I have a lot of this size. Um, because yeah, I just feel like they're very useful for things. So yeah, I love these jars. Then going on to more like decor bits. I have these, which are actually classed as wall art on the website. So you're supposed to have them like this on the wall. However, I have them on my shelves like this. And this one you couldn't really store anything on because the way the pattern is, put some on this side, it would just like slide off. However, this one is really good for like storing things in because it's almost like a little bowl. So yeah, I have these on my shelves and yeah, I just really like them. I have little crystals on this one. They probably would look really nice on the wall, but yeah, for now I just have them on the shelves. This is what it's like at the back as well, if anyone did actually want to add them to the wall. I feel like as well they'd look really nice on a coffee table. Then we have this box, which I've got so many of these boxes now, because I feel like they're really useful for storing things. So I have these boxes in the cupboard doors underneath. 
I shall insert a little clip. These shelves as well are also from Ikea. Off the top of my head, they're called the Billy Shelves. But then the doors are something else. The doors aren't Billy shelves. Because you can just get it so it doesn't have the doors on. But for storage purposes, I just wanted to get, put the doors on so I could like keep everything neat and tidy. Um, so yeah, I have these there. I also have them on my living room shelves, which are also from Ikea. They're called the Vilhal shelves. It's like V-I-H-A-L-S. I think it's got an S at the end. Um, <laughs> I probably said that completely wrong, but that's how you spell it anyway. So yeah, my living room shelves are also from Ikea. But yeah, I just have these just to pop on the shelf. And I just feel like they're good for like hiding things. So like the one in my living room have all, has all like my remotes and like just TV kind of bits in it. And you would never know if you just looked at the shelves. And then the ones I have in this cupboard, I've just got like loads of like admin bits in and they're just all organized with different admin bits in. So yeah, I feel like they're really useful, but also very easy to carry because they've got little holders at the side and yeah you'd easily be able to just put a label on this they are like cardboard if anyone's interested in what the actual texture's like then i have this plant in my bathroom which i just feel like looks really nice it comes like this so it comes in a black pot but then i just got this like off-white pot to put with it and um, that's also from ikea as well and yeah i just have it sitting on my bathroom shelf and i just feel like it looks really nice the towels in my ensuite bathroom that i'm showing are actually sage so i just feel like it sits in my bathroom really nice and just adds a little pop of sage in there so yeah i really love these and i'm sure this plant is really cheap as well like it's not expensive obviously it's artificial um but yeah i just think it just really sits nice and every time i see it i'm like oh i love that little plant then last but not least is this laundry basket now let me show you this laundry basket probably gonna have to stand up for it i don't want to show too much because it does actually have washing in right now but this laundry basket i have in my bathroom and I just feel like it looks nice. Sometimes I feel like laundry baskets don't look very aesthetically pleasing, but I just love the look of this one. Um, and then obviously it's got the handles. So I will literally just have it in my bathroom and fill it up. And then when I'm ready to do a wash, I will literally just carry it to the washing machine. So it's really useful like that. And yeah, I just feel like it's a really nice color. So yeah, I love that. My battery is flashing. So I hope it doesn't die on me. Thank you so much for watching this video. And I'm glad to hear that you all love Ikea just as much as me because I am forever in Ikea and I love a day at Ikea and i love doing videos on ikea so i love that you love the ikea videos just as much as me and yeah thank you so much for watching if you like this video please like and subscribe and yeah thank you so much 